kindergarten students, welcome back to music class, only this time it's by video. I'm so happy to see you again. And of course, if it's music class, are we just going to say hello? Of course not. We're going to review our welcome song. Now, I know you learned this last week. We're just practicing it so that we know it even better. So I'm going to remind you over here is the chart and my flags spell out the word welcome. So let's just review it really quickly with me and then we'll put it to the music. So the first, I'm gonna go first. Welcome, welcome, your turn. Welcome, welcome, very good, my turn. Remember, everybody make your hands move like this. Come right in and stay a while. Come right in and stay a while. Good job. Next one. Welcome. Welcome. Your turn. Welcome. Welcome. And then the most important one, listen. Don't forget your smile. Can you do that? Don't forget your smile. Great. One more time just for review and then we will do it all together with the music. Here we go. Ready? I'm going first. Welcome, welcome. Your turn. Welcome, welcome. Now everybody remember to do this. My turn. Come right in and stay a while. Go. Come right in and stay a while. This time when we sing welcome, let's wave with one hand and then the other hand. So it'll look like this, my turn. Welcome, welcome, your turn. Welcome, welcome. And then the last one, again, my turn first. Don't forget your smile. Don't forget to draw your smile, here we go. Don't forget your smile. Good job, all right, let's do it with the music now. Here we go. Very, very exciting that we can do the whole thing. everybody. I'm very proud of you. I hope you're all doing well today. Today we're going to review a little bit of our Can You Rock and Roll song and we're going to add to it so that we can do the whole song. Now the really important part is when I sing the musical question, can you sing la 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 and we're going to review that. So when I sing that to you, you sing back to me I can sing. Can you do that, please? I can sing. One more time. Ready? Sing it back to me. I can sing. You go. I can sing. And then here are the la la's. I'm going to go first. La 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 la. Your turn. La 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 la. Good job. Let's do that one more time. I'll sing it. You sing it back. La 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 la. Your turn. La 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 la. Good job. Now let's do the question. I will sing the question and you sing the answer back to me. So here we go. Can you sing? La 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 la. And you answer. I can sing. La 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 la. Good job. We have one more to go. The next one's just a little bit different. I will sing. Can you sing? La 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 la. Now, let's try it. First, you're gonna answer. I can sing, go. I can sing, good, okay. Now here's the la la part to this, which is a little bit higher. La 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 la. Can you do that? Time for the la la's. I'll sing it first. La 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 la. Now you can sing it. La 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 la. Great job. 
job. And the last part, I will sing, well, can you, well, can you, and you put your hands on your hips and very confidently you're going to sing, yes, I can. Let's try it. I'll sing the question, you sing the answer. Well, can you, well, can you go? Yes, I can. Well, can you, well, can you? Yes, I can. Great job. All right. I think we should just do the first part of the song and then I'll pause it and I'll teach you the motions for the next part of the song. You will need to stand up. And in the beginning, you can just kind of bounce to the beat of the rock and roll. Here we go. Let's have some musical fun with Can You. So just put them up here and make a circle with your elbows. Can you dig in your heel? Just put your heel down on the floor and wiggle your foot back and forth. It's pretty easy to do. Can you walk like a penguin? Can you let out a squeal? I'm gonna go high. Whee! Can you shrug your shoulders? Can you point to your spleen? You'll have to trust me on this. It's right here. Can you pant like a puppy? <laughs> Can you look kind of mean? Good job. Let's try those one more time before we do them in the song. Okay. Can you wind your elbows? Can you dig in your heel? Again, just put your heel down. And wiggle your foot back and forth. Good job. Can you walk like a penguin? Can you let out a squeal? Whee! Can you shrug your shoulders? Can you point to your spleen? Right here. Can you pant like a puppy? And can you look kind of mean? And then we do the singing again. Can you sing la, 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 But you already know how to do that. So let's add part two of the song. Ready? Get your elbows ready. Can you find your elbows? Can you dig in your heel? Can you walk like a penguin? Can you let us squeal? Can you shrug your shoulders? Can you point to your sleeve? Right here. Can you pant like a puppy? Can you look kind of me? Can you sing la 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 do that whole song all the way from the beginning. You are doing such a beautiful job, okay? 
So here we go with can you, oh, and at the very end, I will sing once more. Well, can you, and I want everybody to say, yes, because you did, you did all those things. All right, so get ready to bounce to the beat with can you. I'm gonna turn the music up just a little bit. Here we go. was fantastic. Okay, wow, you are good musicians today. Now we're going to review and add some new things as we talk about, and I wonder if you remember this word right up here. Does anybody remember what that word is? If you said rhythm, you're wonderful. R, say the letters with me, R-H-Y-T-H-M. And last week, you're so smart, you figured out that there are two letters the same, the H's. Now, last week when we clapped, we used sentences. But today, I want to introduce you to a beautiful drum language that comes from the country of India. And it's really quite fabulous. So, whenever you see the big hands, when we did it last time, we said, I clap my hands. But this week, when you see the big hands, on each of those claps, we say ta. So it looks like this. Ta, 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 ta. Can you do that with me? Ready? Ta, 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 ta. You do it once without me, I'll point, but you need to say the ta and you need to clap. Ready? I'll point and you say go. Ta, 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 ta. Yes! Okay, now also, last week you were so smart, you figured out that these were colored yellow and smaller, and we learned that they were faster. So whenever we do these notes, we say taka. Can you say Taka, try it. Taka. Now we have some big ones. Ta, ta, taka, ta. Let's try clapping and saying that together. Ready, boys and girls? Here we go. Ta, ta, taka, ta. Let's try that again. Ready with me? And ta, ta, taka, ta. Let's try it with you doing it, and I'll just point. 
Ready and go. Yes, good job. Okay, now this bottom one shouldn't be a problem at all. The bottom one, again, we have our fast ones. We have our taka ta, taka ta. Let's try clapping that and saying those. Ready together with me. Taka ta, taka ta. Good. You do it without me. I'll just point. Ready? Here we go. And taka ta, taka ta. Good. Now, since that's new, we're going to go back and we're going to do all of them in a row together. And then I'm going to give you a brand new one today. So here we go. Ready with me. Get ready to clap and say them. And ta, 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 ta. Ta, 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 ka, ta. Ta, ka, ta, ta, ka, ta. Give me a thumbs up if you were able to do all of those. Good job. Okay, here's a new one because you can learn a new one today. Oh, look. In the middle, we have four faster ones. Now, just to get you used to this, I'm going to give you a sentence that goes with this, and it's, I'm going to clap my hands. Let's try saying that and clapping it. I'm going to clap my hands. One more time, ready? I'm going to clap my hands. But now you know the Indian drum language. So let's use that and let's clap it and say it. Here we go. Ta, ta, ka, ta, ka, ta. One more time, here we go. And together with me. Ta, ta, ka, ta, ka, ta. Great job. One more time because this is brand new. Here we go. Last time for it. And ta, ta, ka, ta, ka, ta. Excellent job. I am really proud of you. Give yourselves a video cheer. Yay. Okay. Now, today I have a magical musical story to share with you. And I'm only going to be able to do part of it because it's a long story. So I'll read part today, and then I'll read another part next week. So you can sit back down, as I'm going to. And the name of the story is Orchestranimals. Orchestranimals. And if you look, there are all kinds of animals down here. I am seeing a flamingo and a raccoon and a pelican, oh, and a penguin, an elephant, a bear, a lion. Oh, this should be an exciting story with all those zoo animals in it. Let's find out what adventure they're gonna get up to. Oh, what's this first animal that you see? It's a penguin. And I have to tell you, boys and girls, the penguin is the boss. He is called the conductor. He gets to tell all the other animals in the orchestra what to do. So, and he's kind of grumpy today as our story begins. Where is everyone? Muttered the conductor. Only 10 minutes. I need players to bow, players to blow, and players to hit on the beat. And where's Crash? I don't know, but I'm here, said the octopus, sliding a perfect scale across the piano keyboard. I'm here, said the fox. I had trouble putting my new flute together till I remembered the trick. He waved his flute in the air and sang, the head joints connected to the body joint, the body joints connected to the foot joint. Enough, snapped the conductor. Oh, he's really grumpy, isn't he? I'm here, said the flamingo. Her beak was even blacker than usual. I couldn't find my clarinet. It was mixed in with my children's liquor 
licorice sticks. On here, hiccups the pelican. Right here he is. I see, said the conductor. So what's your excuse? I was playing some high piccolo trills and the seashore, and when the fish started jumping, hundreds of them, I just couldn't let a good meal go by. And look at that pelican. Look at all the little fishies he brought into the, into that. I guess he wanted to have a snack on the go. I'm here, quacked the duck. Behind him, he dragged a bundle of long, wet reeds. I found these in the pond. I'm going to use one for my oboe. There's the oboe right there. I'm here, lisped the anteater, tonguing at his bassoon. Oh, rats, he sniveled. First, I practiced till my tongue got stuck. Then I stubbed my toe on these wretched reeds. I don't think the anteater is very happy. The conductor groaned and kicked the reeds under a chair. Only eight minutes. I still need players to bow, players to blow, and players to hit to the beat. And where's Cat Crash? Hmm. Do you know where Crash is? I don't either. But maybe if we tune in next week and hear some more of the story, we're going to find out who this mysterious Crash is. Boys and girls, it has been lovely being with you again. And of course, it's time to say goodbye. But again, it's music class. Do we just say goodbye? No, we sing goodbye because that's the most fun. Now this week, I'm going to teach you to start singing our goodbye song. So the first thing you need to do is we're going to stand up again. And I'm going to ask you to sing after me. Tickle your chin. Can you do that? Tickle your chin. And then wiggle your nose. It's a little tricky to sing and wiggle your nose, but you can do it. Let's try it. Wiggle your nose. Good, let's try that again. I'll go first and you go after me. Tickle your chin. Your turn. Tickle your chin. Good, here I go. Wiggle your nose. You try that. Wiggle your nose. Good job. Pat on your tummy. You try that. Pat on your tummy. Good. And the next one is, and stand on your toes up, down. Can you do that? And stand on your toes up, down. Good job. Okay, and the only thing I'm going to ask you to sing of the rest of the song is just lift up your fingers, lift up your fingers. Try that one more time. I'll do it first. Lift up your fingers. You do it. Lift up your fingers and wave. Goodbye and wave goodbye. Beautiful. Okay, 
Now sing as much as you can. I'll give you hints. And don't worry if you miss a note or two. We'll get it. The more we practice, the better we get. And that's one of the wonderful things about music. The more you do it, the better you are. So here goes the beginning of our Wave Goodbye song. Remember, tickle your chin first. boys and girls we're gonna go back and do just that much but we will finish the song this time okay so here we go let me see those beautiful smiles we're almost finished today for music and I just want to have you remember please that every day is magical when you have music see you next week bye